Hello, friends. I'm gonna go ahead and wait for everyone to get here. I can't remember if I did my last thing of setting spray, so we're gonna do that too. <clears throat> That's about how much I do every time I do my setting spray. <clears throat> so when I am doing my pre-makeup routine, I always do a setting spray, primer, setting spray. I swear by that routine. It really holds all your makeup in a place super well throughout the day. And also helps to um, minimize the appearance of pores, helps to cap fine lines increasing. It does a ton for your skin. So definitely an important step to make sure that you're doing before any foundation. Um, and then if you guys have missed it, the foundation and concealer that I always use are still on sale and available in the um, holiday special. And the holiday special ends tomorrow at midnight Pacific Standard Time. So you only have today and tomorrow to be able to get it. So you get um, your choice of primer, get the mattifying, that's my personal favorite, and your choice of foundation and your choice of concealer. So you get all three of these for $70. So that is such a banging deal and so much savings. I believe that also comes with free shipping if I'm remembering correctly. But you get all of this. And then um, easy add-ons are like your kabuki brush to apply your foundation with, things like that. So if you guys need any help being color matched, make sure to comment color match um, down below and I'll private message you. And then I will go ahead and leave you guys the shopping link right here in the comments. So this is where you can find all of the makeup and everything that I'm sharing right there. And then everything has a love it guarantee. So if something doesn't match perfectly for any reason, you can return it for your money back or exchange for another color. All of that's an option. So feel free to grab your foundation concealer. And even if you already know your color, I would stock up because this is the only time the foundation will be on sale. Yes. Perfect. Awesome. I will, I'm caught up on all my messages yesterday, so I'll catch up again today if you've messaged me since last night or today. Um, and then the foundation, you can choose between any of them. So you could choose between the Serum Plus, you could choose the spray, you can choose the stick, you can choose the BB cream. So the deal is not just on one, you get to choose. So say you know you love the Serum Plus foundation, but even wanting to try the stick foundation for those drier days, you can try that too. So all of that goes into play. Yay. Okay. So we'll go ahead and get started. So we are going to do our Serum Plus foundation. This has been my go-to and my favorite um, because of how long the last is like on your skin. So I've been wearing this nonstop since it launched and I'm still like so incredibly amazed with how phenomenal the coverage is. One, it's full coverage. Two, it lasts like 12 plus hours. And when I say that, I mean like you don't have to touch it up after a few hours. It stays on all day and it's really good underneath a mask. So if you are masked, you don't have to worry about your foundation looking blotchy or looking like it came off altogether. I don't think I'll ever go brunette, no. <laughs> it took too many years to get me this light. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna use my uh, Serum Plus foundation in the shade Lace today. My my uh, self-tan are starting to wear off, so I'm gonna go back to my winter shade, which is Lace. And like I said, I'm using the Kabuki brush to blend this in all over, just like so. And you just wanna like bounce dab it on all over and look at how fast this coverage is so so good so if you have mature skin and you have dry mature skin I would do the stick foundation if you have mature skin and your combination or more oily then you can do the serum plus but honestly the foundation I'm using is good for all skin types whether you feel dry oily any of the above so um yeah serum plus is always my like go-to I wore my mask for eight plus hours or so, and it always looks perfect underneath. Amen to that, sister friend. Oh, so, so good. So you can do the, I think the pressed powder is not an option for the bundle. I could be wrong, but I want to say it's not. So I would go ahead and add that on to your order. All right, so now that we have our base layer of our spray foundation in the shade Lace on, Guys, this coverage is phenomenal. So, so good. I'm dry skin and it's never patchy. I love it. I love reading your guys' like authentic reviews. 
All right, so now I'm gonna go in with just like a teeny tiny bit more. And I like to do this on the highest parts of my cheeks so it has like room to roll if it does. And then going in immediately with my blending buds from Unique. So these are really important to make sure you go over your foundation with because this is a good part, especially if you have dry skin or large pores because this is going to compress the makeup down in a place versus just like swirling it on top. So this is going to make your makeup look softer and more flawless on your skin, especially if you have large pores, fine lines and wrinkles and things like that. Hello from Canada. I have used the airbrush, but like more coverage. What's good match for Sable? Um, message me because I'm not sure. I can't remember what Sable looks like. So send me a message, Christina, and I will help you with that. Um, for airbrush coverage. So you can either do the spray foundation, which is an airbrush, or if you're wanting more coverage, do the serum plus foundation. Cause this gives as good, if not better coverage. And it is, like I said, that smudge proof, that resistant phenomenalness. So, so good. Maureen, make sure you reach out to support. Okay, so now for foundation is on. Now we're going to go in with our concealer in the shade Organza. And I'm going to apply this on my under eye. This is my favorite concealer in the whole world. And the reason is, it is so, so good at hiding dark circles and at brightening your under eye, which gives you that really nice youthful appearance. And it's super good, especially if you have like darker eyelids like I do. Look how soft and bright that is. Isn't that amazing? So this is the concealer that is the option in the holiday special. So you get foundation and concealer and primer for 70, or you can do just the foundation and concealer for 50. So really, really good deal for how much you get with all of your products. So if you've been wanting to try, now's the time to do it. And if you need help picking out your products, again, just reach out to me here on Facebook. Thank you. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and go in with our setting powder. So a good point for you, Linda, is making sure that you're using like the mattifying face primer is really good because that's going to help to minimize the appearance of pores. Also, if you're not exfoliating, everyone should be exfoliating like at least two times a week. I can always tell on my own skin when I need to exfoliate because same thing. I'll start to see that my makeup isn't setting as as well as it did or could. So making sure that you are setting your makeup, I'm sorry, making sure you're exfoliating your skin is going to be really important. So um, my favorite way to exfoliate is using the exfoliating face mask by Unique. Um, and using that like two to three times a week. And I love using the Cora 3, which is a facial brush by Fancy, to apply it. Okay, perfect, Elizabeth. So I went ahead and used my Touch Bold setting powder for this step. Now what this is gonna do is this is going to just soak up any oils that try to make our foundation look shiny, greasy, oily, anything like that. So we're gonna just sweep away, just like that. And then now we're gonna use our pressed powder to even out our coverage and just make it look overall the best. Um, Regina, I would reach out to support. It should last longer than that. Um, but for the Serum Plus Foundation, I would recommend to do the Kabuki brush because of how dense it is. This will apply it much better and much more flawless. And I feel like that's a good point to make too. I was talking to someone today and she was like, I'm applying my foundation with my hands and it blotches and looks terrible. So the thing about using your hands to apply any makeup at all is our hands have natural oils in them, which can cause our foundations or our makeup to become like a different consistency altogether because the oils are so fastly absorbed into makeup. So that's why when you like touch your face or things like that, it can mess up your, our makeup um, if you're not setting it correctly. So make sure to not use your hands. Make sure you're using good quality brushes and tools like the Kabuki brush to apply your liquid foundation. Um, Diana, a good thing for you to do, I would stick with the shade Eyelet and I would just get a pressed powder in a darker shade like the shade Taffeta. Um, but the next shade up would be the shade Taffeta. All right, so now I'm going in with my pressed powder 
in the shade Taffeta. And the reason is that I'm using a darker found or pressed powder is because now this is really going to even out my skin. So if my liquid foundation was looking a little bit light, which lace is a little bit light, but I'm a little too pale for eyelet right now. So this is a really good combination of the two is the two shades kind of mixing together to equal out to my skin tone. So here you can see on this side versus that side, this side just looks like it matches so much better. The pressed powder also is amazing because it has shea butter and vitamin E infused in it. So it's also going to help your makeup match. I'm sorry, make sure that your makeup looks really soft still and not powdery, cakey, anything like that. So definitely snag the pressed powder if you haven't. Okie dokie. Now that we have our pressed powder on, again, we use the shade Taffeta. Now let's go in with our contour and blush, which really, really help our makeup match even better as well because it's going to kind of create dimension to our skin versus looking a little washed out. So I'm going to go in with our beachfront bronzer and our tapered blusher brush and grab this on there and then go from the top of the ear towards the corner of the mouth. And I'm just going to kind of etch a little line here. Stop. And then same thing on this side a little line here and swirl to blend that in underneath the jawline now this is really going to help our makeup match better because they're adding dimension to our skin and it also is really going to help create that uh like warmth to your skin too that just gives you like that healthy glow and I always tell you guys too, this is a really kind of cool trick if you ever feel like your makeup looks lighter in some areas because you can kind of play off of that and in those lighter areas can act as like a highlight and then wherever you put a contour is going to recede and look like it gives you more depth. So easy peasy lemon squeezy. The shade Sunset is still available in the beachfront bronzer as well. So now for blush, we're going to go in with the shade Sisterly, which is my favorite because it it's so, so stunning. It's a really, really soft pale pink and it illuminates your cheek structure and really does uh, do a lot for using like an easy little blush. Plus it has a really pretty sheen to it too. What color pressed powder are you using? I use the shade Taffeta. And then if you guys missed it, I took you guys to our new house today on Instagram stories and showed you guys the new progress with construction. So if you aren't following me on Instagram yet, make sure you do so. My name there is Raya Hope. And then you can just click the profile picture for the stories to play. All right, so now we're gonna do a little highlight, do the Touch Elmo Luminizer. Candy, I would make sure to exfoliate your under eyes using the exfoliating face mask and make sure that you're using your primer really well there. But yes, using a little bit less concealer would help and then also making sure that your brushes and your blending buds are clean. I always can tell when I need to wash my makeup brushes because my makeup will look a little cakey and it's always because my um, brushes are dirty. How rewards link links work. So you go to my website, which is here, you can click on rewards link, and then you'll just enter in your email. And when you're shopping on my website, at the bottom of the website, we'll say rewards link, you'll just select your name, you're going to want to make sure that you see my name at the top. So it should say Rhea Coleman as a sponsor. And then at the bottom for rewards link, you'll select your name. So what it does is you get like a percentage of your order as a reward. So once you get to 200 points, which $200, you get um, $20 Ycash. And Ycash is essentially like free makeup, free skincare. Ycash can be used on anything on my website minus things that are already on sale or things that are 30 days brand new. So for example, the lipsticks just launched 30 days ago. So the white cash can be used on those starting on like the 17th, I believe. Um, and then same with the lip liners. Lip liners will go, will be eligible for white cash in like three weeks. So um, the 30 day mark is that. Yes, Tina, I show you guys the new layout for the new closet. So exciting. Um, so yeah, make sure you're definitely setting up a rewards link before you check out. It only, it's just like... It's just like if you go to Sephora and you have like a rewards like 
card or a phone number. Um, just the only difference is the rewards links that you set up are only good for 10 days. So after that 10 days, you have to set up a new link if you're going to place your order. And the other cool thing about it too, is that when you set up your rewards link and say, okay, so say Candy, set up her rewards link, place her order for $100. There, that link is good for 10 days, like I said. So what Candy should do is go and text all of her friends and family that link and say, I have nine days left on my link if you want any makeup or skincare or whatever, here's my link. So say Candy's mom places an order for $100. Now Candy is qualified for the 200 and she gets $20 white cash. So it's essentially kind of almost like being an influencer for free makeup and skincare. <laughs> so it's a really cool, easy thing and you don't need me to set it up. I can if you want me to, but um, it's really easy. You just go to my website and click rewards link and then you click create rewards link, put in your info and it pops up right there. All right, so for brows, real quick, we're gonna do the brow uh, sculpting pencil. I'm almost out of this and I'm like so impressed with how long this has lasted. I've had this since the launch of the brow product, which is so cool. It's lasted so many months. Yeah, so I hope that it helped explain it. I always try to kind of clue you guys in when I color match you how to set those up, but it's super duper easy. But the only like tricky part is, is realizing that you only have 10 days for it. I know, who doesn't like free makeup, right? And I believe the Y cash doesn't expire for a year. Could be mistaken on that, but I know it lasts for quite a while. You just can't use it on things that are already on sale or 30 days brand new. All right, so I'm just kind of etching around my brows and now I'm gonna take the little uh, brush that it comes with and then just kind of smoosh and smear this out to make it look really soft and natural. But I just love how framing, or I'm sorry, filling in your brows really does frame your face and just is so flattering on. Even if you're not trying to do like a full glam look, but simply doing this step really does do a lot for your overall face shape. And it gives you like almost like a mini eye lift. I'm not in a hurry. I feel like I'm going slow. <laughs> so why cash is like what you get. So rewards link is the link. And then the Y cash is what you get from the rewards link. Does that make sense? Kind of like, um, like on Amer or Abercrombie. When I shop, when I sign into my account, um, and I place an order after so many orders, I get like Y cash. I get credit for that website. So that's what it is. Okay. Trying to go slow. Uh, eyeliner in the shade perfect. On the waterline, this is my favorite eyeliner because it actually stays on. Stays where you put it. And it doesn't give you raccoon eyes or smear or smudge or anything. Hello from Chicago. All right, so eyeliner's on. And then for eyes today, we're just going to do something really soft. So I'm going to take my palette 9 and then I'm going to grab this shade right here, which is optimal, on top of my fluffy crease brush. And I'm just going to pop this all over my eyelid. This is a really easy thing to do if you find that your eyes crease a lot with foundation concealer on them. So the, uh, the eyeshadow I'm using has primer infused in it. So it really does help with holding everything in a place. And it helps to prevent any creasing if your eyes are prone to creasing. Thank you. Are there any Black Friday deals coming up? Yes, Jen. Um, so our Black Friday deals are already started. They're called holiday specials on our website and they're actually going for the remainder of the month and into next month. There's gonna be 10 total bundles. And if you get eight of the 10 bundles, then you get a special beauty bar, which is like a Sonic, um, helps reduce collagen in your skin. But the last or the current bundle right now is only available until tomorrow. So definitely make sure you snag it. So the bundle is any foundation, any concealer for $50. And if you wanna add on the primer, it's only 70. So you get primer, foundation, concealer for $70. It's actually a really, really good deal. We did buy a new house, yes. We're in the remodel process with it. Yay, oh my gosh. Palette Nine is my favorite 
was actually just talking to someone the other day about this. This is like such a great palette. It has all the best neutrals. The brow pencil that I use is called the Brow Sculpting Pencil, and it's available on my website under Brows. All right, for lips, we're going to do our lip liner in the shade uh, Polite, which is a really good nude. And I love these lip liners because they're super creamy. They're retractable. They have a sharpener on the other end. And they're smudge proof, transfer proof. So they're really, really good at filling in your whole lip. So I like to fill it in. Yay, isn't this the best? I love this lipstick or lip liner color. And this is so good, especially if you have fine lines and wrinkles around your lips to hold all of that in so you don't experience any bleeding with your lipsticks. Okay, and now I'm gonna go in with the lipstick in the shade Loaded. This is a really fun, like kind of berry color. So Debbie, it doesn't have to be two shades lighter. If you want a very bright under eye, you can do a sh uh, shade lighter. But if I recommended Velour in your concealer and foundation, it's because I thought Organza might be too bright and the shade Lace is out of stock. So the shade Velour would be a better match for you. Um, that is probably why I did what I did. All right, so now for lip gloss, we're gonna do the shade Lonesome on top. I know, well-to-do lipstick is my favorite. It's so hard for me not to use it every single day. I just don't wanna be boring. <laughs> You're like, oh, same lipstick. And this is gonna change this lipstick color into kind of like a softer berry. Oh, that's awesome, Rita. All right, so loaded lipstick with lonesome lip gloss on top. And now let's set our makeup and do our lashes. So I always like to set my makeup before I do my lashes because I find that if I do it the other way, my lashes are just, I'm just creating like a more, I'm creating more of an issue later. So for example, if I were to do my lashes and then do my setting spray, I'm just making my lashes more wet, which is not helping my situation if my lashes touch my eyes or anything like that to create any transferring. So really, really important to do your setting spray before you do your mascara. Yay, Kathy, I'm so excited. And yes, you can get as many of those bundles as you're wanting. Someone messaged me yesterday and was like, can I get more than one? Because it's such a good deal. And heck to the yeah, you can buy as many bundles as you'd like until supplies last. So the bundle, like I said, is foundation, concealer, primer. So definitely grab those before the deal's gone, which is, it ends tomorrow. Um, Velour, the shade Debbie. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Debbie, the shade Velour <laughs> in your concealer. Yeah, it makes a really big difference for sure. All right, so for lashes, we're gonna do the lash primer. Base of the lash all the way up. And this is a really, really good little trick uh, for your lashes to get them to look even longer because this not only gives them length, but also gives them hydration. Okay, so now that we have our primer on, now I'm gonna go in with my Twisted Mascara. The lipstick color I'm wearing today is the shade Loaded with the lip liner in Polite and the lip gloss in the shade Lonesome. But this mascara is a really good add-on too. And if you're looking for the biggest bang for your buck, uh, the Eye Essential Bundle is still available, which what that is, is it's any mascara, the Twisted or the 4D, a liquid eyeshadow and the eyeliner too. And I believe it also comes with your brush. 
if I'm remembering correctly. But those two bundles, the holiday special plus the eye essential bundle is the best. Highly recommend to get it. Because then you have everything for face and eyes. But look at those lashes, you guys. So good. That's a twisted mascara with the lash primer for you. And it also has this teeny tiny little wand, which is really good at reaching those harder to get eyelashes. And then like I had said, make sure to send me a message today if you need to be color matched. All you have to do is comment color match down below and or message me and I can tell you what color foundation you are if you're not sure. But make sure you get your orders in for that foundation ASAP before that deal is gone. All right, so there's the makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed that little quickie, easy weekend look. Um, like I had said, the foundation, concealer, and primers on sale only until tomorrow. The eye essential bundle is always on sale and always an option, um, but it's a really good add-on if you um, are looking for like the biggest bang for your buck. So definitely check that out. And then let me know if you guys need anything or need any help picking out your products. I'm here to help. And make sure you're shopping down here. Make sure you see my name and or my photo before checking out. So you should see Rhea Coleman or my face. So let me know if you guys need anything and I will see you guys tomorrow. And if you'd like to see um, the updates on the new house, make sure to head to Instagram. And my name there is Rhea Hope. All right, guys. I'll see you soon. Bye.